Hi everyone, Messi Coder here. Welcome to another Unity video, and this time I'm starting a new little series where I'm going to be playing and checking out assets, but not exactly giving them a review and a score at the end of it. These are kits that, well, they're quite code heavy, and I don't have the time to sit and go through all of the code and give it a decent enough review that I would feel just in giving it a score. So, but I still want to play with them, I still want to check them out and have fun. And this one is Driver Traffic System from Medi Rebi. Uh, it looks like GTA in the video. I've been given a copy of it. Um, I want to have a Mac about and show you guys what it's like, especially as it's currently on sale. I figured there's a few people out there that I have been messaged and asked about this, which is why I've been given a copy. So um, I'd like to thank you all again. Hey, why are you walking into this lamppost? Yeah, mate, let me give you a push. Let me help you out. There you go. There you go, buddy. Oi! You! What are you doing? What are you doing? Use the road. Where are you going? Oi! Control yourself. Bloody hell. Alright, so uh, yeah, I'd like to thank everyone. Oi, I think he's heard me. He's a bit upset. So, oi, oi, come back here. I've got your number, mate. I've got your number. Come back here. I'll have to call the cops. So, as I was trying to say before, he rudely interrupted me. I'd like to thank everyone who um, follows, uh, subscribes, puts comments down. There's a lot of you out there who are actually going off and contacting asset creators on my behalf and <laughs> saying that, hey, have you seen this guy does reviews and checks out assets? Um, I'd like to see him do a video of one of your stuff. I really appreciate that. I really do. I've had people contacting me on Facebook and on YouTube and basically saying, here's my um, key for one of my stuff. Would you like to check it out and do and you know, see if you have fun. And actually some people are just saying, would you like to check it out and let me know what you think, not even do a video. So wow, um, I like to really, really um, appreciate, say thank you how much I appreciate that. Don't run me over Mr. Scorebus man. Um, that, is, that is huge. So uh, thanks, thanks a lot. Um, it is brave though because um, this bloke is still walking into the lamppost. Anyone who has seen my reviews and my videos knows that he just doesn't want to stop hugging that lamppost that um, I do keep, I don't, I am honest and I do point out stuff like this. This is a uh, traffic system and we've got a bit of a pile up here. I haven't done anything to interact with this lot and they've just freaked out. So um, this is a great, great start of me trying to explain how I don't hide the truth from you guys. No matter if you're going to give me a free copy you're gonna, you're gonna get the true show. This place got a, This was not. Was that my car? No, this is my car. So they complaining that I've parked here and I've just freaked everyone out. Let's get in. Let's get in. <laughs> so, all right. Um, without um, furthermore, do I mean, we've got a hundred vehicle. Look at the top left. I mean. I don't think. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. Wee! <laughs> so guys, sit back. Um, enjoy. Once again, thank you for all of your help and your support. I'm getting away from them. <laughs> if we get in any more trouble. So, wow. Um, I'll see you guys in a second. Hey everyone. Barry White here with another Unity Asset Review and this time it's a little bit different. I'm not going to be doing a review, I'm making a new little mini-series where I'm going to be just previewing, checking out, mucking about with asset kits. These are ones that have got basically a lot of code and I don't have the time to sit down and delve through all of the code to give it a proper review, but I want to still have a play, check it out and show you guys. And if you do like some of these kits I'm playing about with, then put down in the comments which ones you want me to explore a little bit more and maybe make some tutorials on. So we're starting off with Driver Traffic System from Medi Rabi, I think he pronounced his name. And it looked like in the videos that we could make something like GTA. It kind of looked very GTA-ish. You get in a car, you get in a bike, you drive around a city, there's people, there's traffic, there's cars, there's there's stuff, really. So it looked quite cool. Um, let's just, before I pop in, 
I want to go to the AI controller, maximum number of vehicles, uh, let's put that to 50. And if I put my num lock on, then it would work. Maximum humans, let's say 100 humans. Let's say 100 cars and 100 humans. Okay, and that would randomly just pick through all of these. And here you can just drag and drop your um, prefab for your humans, and your prefabs for your vehicles. Lovely. And you see here you've got the traffic system, that's how you set it up, and you say the directions on where they're going to go. These are the intersections very simple very basic looking um, system quite the same as any other traffic system that you'd see for sale on the asset store really um, the this is a guy who did the realistic um, car controller um, so he's good car controller on that realistic car controller it's quite realistic and it's the name let me just have a sip of my coffee that's yeah, better. That might help the voice. That might help Barry White disappear for a little bit. Um, and if I look at the car script here, you can see there's a lot. You've got a lot of, um, well, sounds. Car settings. Here we go. So it does have a, a lot of settings for this car. Likewise for the motorbike. Bike power, shift power, brake power, gears. Well, okay. So there's a lot of settings. There is a README. The README is not incredibly detailed, but that's enough of me just chatting and waffling. Let's pop in and click the magic play button. Let's go here, maximize on play. Let's click play. See what happens when we're driving around. Okay. So, hang on. I don't like that music. Let's let's go back and. Where's our player? And let's turn off that music. Where are your music? Main camera. Music. Audio source. Alright, let's just turn that off. Because I'll just stick over it some other music. Here we go. So here's Blokey. Here's, you go on this side, you can get on it. If I go on this side, I can't. Okay. Push F. Hey, uh, someone walking around. In the top left, we can see that we've spawned 39, 40 out of 100 vehicles. Spawned 13, 14 humans. Spawning and despawning. So they're going down now. It's odd. Is that because of the area I'm in? Oh, why have they got the humans gone down to 6, 5, 100 humans? More vehicles, though. There's a cop car. There's a van. No, they got the curves. Here's a school bus. And wow. Okay. I've got a bus on my head. That's impressive. Does the police do anything? Sideswipe. Woo! He did. There's a lot. He did his siren, but. That's it. He's not doing anything else. C for camera. That's quite cool. Okay. So there is an event, so you could tap into that event that makes him do his siren and have him get out and chase you down. That's a different camera angle. Let's try and take on this bus again. Oh, yeah. I'm indestructible. Look how tough I am. It's a very arcadey. Very arcadey. It's nice that they've got a different collection of camera angles. It's a nice touch. They're not fantastic. Wow. Okay. Oh, bugger. Okay. So that's the controller for the vehicles. It's not fantastic, to be honest. It's arcadey. I don't know if it's supposed to be a placeholder and you. Just it, but I, 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 oi, oi, here you go. Get out. That's nice. You can drag people out of their cars, like in GTA. We got ourselves a little van here. Can I do anything in this van? Can I knock? Okay. They can't get knocked down. 
the taxi. Where's, where's the. Can't beat my horn. Well, turbo. Wow. Oh, I can run people over. Nice. Um, let's, let's try running someone else over. Oh. God, indestructible mailbox. Indestructible mailbox. Let's see if I can run this guy over. Oh, nice. Okay. There you go. And let's do, let's get a bus. Let's get the school bus. Get out. Gonna mow them down in the school bus. Or oh, not. We're gonna push them gently. Push them push them gently along the road in our school bus. Oh, managed to get one. Yes. Picked up a bit of speed. Nope. Nope, pushing them gently out of the way. Nope, pushing them gently out of the way. Okay, so the, the game also doesn't like to to hurt people. It likes to gently push them as you're driving your school bus. So there has to be a certain amount of speed that you have to get to before you can run anyone over. Well, that's pretty much it. I mean... There's not much else to it, to be honest. You've got the NPCs that walk around. Um, let's check out the net. Let's do Control Shift P. Okay, uh, let's go here. So let's check out the nav mesh. So here's the nav mesh that the NPCs are walking around. Um, and it's yeah, you got only walkable and walkable jumps, there's no extra, like, there's no like, crossing areas for NPCs, they can't cross the roads. If you look at the nav mesh, you can see the nav mesh here, and what they've done is he's made this path, yeah, and that's made up of lots of just planes, one after the other, and then he said, okay, that's why I want my NPCs to be walking around. Interesting. Played about a little bit more with the kit, and I found in the main camera, I can actually turn off the mouse cursor that's good um, I'm not sure why the AI script, AI script is attached to the main camera rather than some kind of separate world control or, or like main game controller up here um, that's weird so yeah so that's it for the driver traffic system from Medi Revy so the good news is like I said it is not a complete asset like game so you won't find people asset flipping this all over steam so congratulations but what it does do it gives you a relatively decent traffic system to have cars going around your game stopping at the traffic lights letting people pass what it doesn't have is um, pedestrian crossings so people can safely cross the road without getting mowed down by oncoming traffic I mean, it's easy to add, um, like, you can emulate the stop of the traffic lights, have a pelican crossing or something. And um, if you do want to see more on the driver traffic system, then drop me a comment below. Um, let me know what aspects you would like me to expand upon, or if there's any other assets that you want me to check out. Also, drop them in the comments below. Actually, this one was provided to me from... Lady Revy, uh, thank you very much. I would like to say a big thank you. Also, that anyone who does provide me a key for their assets, you are so brave, very brave, in letting me play with your stuff and making a video on it. Um, I, I think I'm fair. Somebody said harsh but fair the other day, but I think I'm kind and fair. Kind and fair, messy coder. That's what I am. I'm a very fair honest fellow and um, yeah sometimes I just don't like stuff and I'll, and I'll call you out on it well this one I can see this potential I haven't gone through all of the code so I can't give any comments whatsoever on the quality of the code if it's a pile of pants or if it is really you know good quality stuff but out of the box just playing about with the demo I can see it's got potential I just don't think that you're gonna get yourself a GTA game like straight away without any effort um, thank God for that, really. That's all I can say. Because the last thing we want to see is the Steam Asset Store full of asset flips again. So, in that, that's me having my rant. I've got my coffee, got my cheesy toast, 
and I'm going to sit down and enjoy them. So guys, if you do like these videos and you want to see more, do click on that big juicy red subscribe button and tell your friends. And if you do like it, click it. Till next time. If you want to see more of my crazy videos, click on the left side of your screen now. And down below, there's that big juicy subscribe button. And right next to it is the magic bell that if you click it, it will tell you if I've got a new video coming out. Till next time.